Hey guys, it's Broker Prince, and welcome back to my FIFA 17 Liverpool Crew Remote. Continuing on in the Champions League of Season 5. Looking to get a better result than the first game. Where I was uh, not able to break down the defense of my opposition. They held out for a nil-nil draw. I uh, will not make that same mistake again. Bruges actually won their first game, so this a win here against them will put me top of the group. Well, these two really teams enough, already played the of match day one. Now they are involved in this fixture. I'm playing out pretty Champions much Cup the same team that played two. against. Yeah, it's going to be an interesting one. Except uh, Cox is coming in from both sides at the cam position one, so instead of the they can achieve that. But coming up is so Bruges playing around. Liverpool. Liverpool feeling good about their own game. Sporting are also playing Monaco. Last time out, they won at home. Obviously, Sporting could. Yeah, good also solid 1-0 win, one point and point capable point. of more of the same here. I'm hoping I can score enough goals that I will not matter. So this is how the hosts line up today. 4-3-3, and they've got really natural wide players in that front three with the central striker. Role, who is I think that's the key, the because players. those lads on the flanks, mm -hmm. it's quite a complicated that's job that's actually, that's because that's they've got to eight. come inside, support the centre forward, and they've got to pull back when they haven't got the ball, so yeah. an onus on them. This is the Liverpool side. Well, it's the old joke, isn't it, Alan? Diamonds aren't forever, but they are for this game anyway, for this manager. Yeah, very far. Way, doesn't it? We've got those lads on the side of the diamond quite wide. I think they might tuck in when they haven't got the ball just to try and stay nice and solid through the middle. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Came in with the challenge and the ball. Clear away. Gomez. Fior. And that was a very well timed tackle. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. No. And out wide, they were in a good position until that defender this is it very because promptly and decisively. Shielding the ball and pulling onto the ball is not part of professional football, I think. No, that's, that's, that's an illusion. It's only for amateurs. Attacking now. Oh, this is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening. There's a falling over for players who don't even have the ball. A timely challenge. Oh man, come on. Advantage for Liverpool. Can they go with that? There we go. There we go. First Champions League goal of the season. Why it took me 21 minutes into my second group stage in the season to get it, I don't know. Do that much. Well, but uh, it is the first Liverpool goal for defenders. Why was that? For Felina Vidal, I believe to be the Adarese region. I don't know for sure. But that's Martin Molina Vidal. And that has opened the scoring. 1 0 here. Thomas Pina. Oh, am I gifted him an instant second goal? Oh, penalty! Has to be a penalty! Oh, and that's a penalty! Dumb decision. And he's gone. He has produced the red card. Straight away, you knew he now the floodgates. No arguments. Can open Alan at this the slide tackle that went wrong. Well, he's I mean, it had to be a red card. Um, do I want to I do actually from the spot. Great penalty. Boom, scored. Two nil. In a matter of minutes, 
And now I'm playing against 10 men. Nicely knocked in from the penalty spot. Made it look easy. Yeah. You can add your own dots. You can connect those dots. You can probably guess where this is probably going to go. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Restarting at 2 0. In four minutes, he scored two goals. This should. Uh, this is. Attacking well here. Confidence boost that the team they needed. The this team needed here. anyway after that uh, nil nil draw. With the uh, could make a chance with this tackle. Portuguese. Peter. He's side. Uh, uh, Porto. In the first game. So some Vesa. I'm just worried about the rain only in that it's uh, impairing a bit our visibility of the turns out there on the ball. Yeah, we're not the Danny Alves region. He's made the save. Chip Cox. Oh, oh, I hit the post. That's a great clearance. Oh, it could be dangerous. Nadal in off the post this time. He completes his hat trick. He's really been on form. It's spectacular for fashion. Well, it got a bit of help from the inside of the post, but it, in it goes. Well, that he took the ball away from the defenders. When it goes in off the inside. And after Cox was denied by the post, Vidal has no such problems. Luck favoured him, and Liverpool are really on top he, he has a hat trick. Esquerdo. Not bad, considering he couldn't score or for love nor money against here. Sporting. Well, they've been uh, thwarted here. That's a sign of better things to come. Here's Moya. The header. Super header, narrowly wide. Header wasn't yeah, exactly was booty to the spot there. Good one. It was never really going towards the target. Of added time here, three minutes. Crisp defending there. Is Moya going to get there? He's oh, not. The goalkeeper. So that probably means it'll probably it'll, uh, looks like it's gonna be three 0 at half time. And I'll uh, check up on the other scoreline, but during my uh, lead, for half time. Sporting will need to be winning by four goals to well, match me. And even though they lost to Bruges. I can't see Monaco being 4 0 down. It's 1 0. See? So, Sporting have also scored their first. I can't remember what the scoreline between Bruges and Monaco was. And the was. kickoff for the second half of their second game tomorrow. in the Champions Cup group stage. So, I enjoyed the first half, and uh, I don't think it would be too much different in the second. Regardless, they're 1 0, which would put me comfortably at the top of this. Well, not comfortably. I'll be one point ahead of Bruce, but I'll be where I uh, in the midfield area would hope to be. I was hoping to be on six points, Back not again. four, Stay but mate. you know, you can't always have what you want. Or at least now. not exactly what you want. Good, the shot's on. What a fine save. good save from the front. He's spotting it up now to take the, the, the corner. And he's up for the header. He's made the save. Intercepted well. Shit. Space for the shot. Ooh. In spectacular style. Wow. That could have ended badly. Celebration there. 
Uh, luckily, that will be didn't. Free kick against Liverpool. Uh, they are 50 50 apparently. He just because their player fell down like a bitch, Good he was fouled. From them. Slip past his man now. That certainly helps the goalkeeper and those in the middle to stop the cross like that. Getting set at the corner. Win that. Well, it will be a throw. It's gone out of that player there. That throw is literally... Damn it. Got a set-piece specialist, haven't they? And this might just suit him. These days, going off your feet like that is running the risk of the referee taking serious action. Well, he's tried to, go to make a stupid challenge. Uh, he's a faction off getting the ball. It is a foul. Ooh. Oh, great work by the Point got there anyway. I accidentally ran into the goal instead of stopping on the line, and then I almost ran into a fun, which would have been bad, especially if I knocked him down. And that's dealt with the problem. There we go. Chance for a counter attack. You in the direction. This could be it. Moya, clean through on go. Oh, oh. the shot. Still a chance in there. And he his shot is safe. He'll have another go this time. He makes no mistake. Four nil. Top spot is mine. I mean, the three points are mine. Well, I think a lot of you will probably say, ah, but the three points are very much yours as soon as they went down to ten men. Which would be a fair argument, actually. I couldn't really say, you know what, they don't have... Wait, they're wrong. It's I couldn't say that. Be a, a comfortable game, this 4-0. So, Thomas Pina. Yeah. Well, this attack has got a bit of menace to it. Well, they're building steadily here, working away. Well, they passed their way up into a good position Gomez. here. And then just lost the concentration. Really? Lost the ball as well. Yeah. Back. back. They cope with it well defensively. He got it's the last to defender, so that oh. will be a corner. Who apparently is now doing defensive be substitution because of the red card. This team. It's just like fuck this. Get rid of it. Gomez. Anywhere just but the back of our net will be. Shots on here. Ooh. Real go. Well, you can't knock him. He was in the right place at the right time. Just couldn't uh, so, find the finishing touch. Huh? Where is shot? Not exactly something to rival uh, Daniel. On my watch. <laughs> this is a uh, great strike to his career. Decision is a throw. It was a fair tackle. Makes the challenge here. He's given the possession away here. Goal news from Monaco. It's a third goal for the visitors. 80 minutes played. 3 1. Oh, many oh wow, look at that. Scoring 3 1. I didn't even see it tell me it was 2 1. But uh, look like Sporting will also be on four That's points. <laughs> means Bruges will even be in the very top. best. Because uh, boring will overtake break. Comes in with a tackle. Really strong tackle. And probably on Balls goal difference as well. And the cross coming in. Like I said, I don't it's really usually remember the result the from the first quite easily, actually. Monaco game, but. There goes the cross. They won 4 now. And shoots! The shot gets blocked. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. 85 minutes played. Five anyway, goal difference doesn't really matter when you have more points. 4 0 here and almost time up. What does this mean for their next game? Well, that's straightforward for the goalkeeper. Of course, it's only two games in, so. It's not something uh, I think Bruges will be uh, sweating too. A ball away from him with much. the tackle. Monaco might be sweating. Good though, progress with this attack. Two games. And two losses. Very much in free kick territory. 
This foul. And next they have to play me. So. It doesn't get easier. Defender to it first. Sure. For the uh, French side. There's a full time one for Liverpool. Oh. The Dow gets his ball. Oh. I get three points and four goals. Pretty solid game, really. Gives me a good confidence going into the Merseyside Derby. This is the guy I've been scouting for two months. I'm scouting. I'm keep, I'm trying to keep an eye on him because of that 200 valuation. But it looks like he's going absolutely nowhere. Very fast. I'll give him one more month. Things have a good way of working themselves out, don't they? Look at that. I didn't even notice that until just now. Manchester United lost their last match and Spurs. There's just drew their last Premier League match. I wonder if that was. I wonder if that United loss was caused by me getting into their heads. It's after that uh, cup game mm, in the League Cup. Because that makes it two consecutive losses. <laughs> Suckers. Spurs drop two points. I don't know why. Who against? Doesn't really matter. Hello to you once again. Martin Tyler here. Welcome to Goodison Park. It's the Merseyside derby, the People's Club, as Everton refer themselves, and Liverpool, with the greater history, really. But that's all forgotten today. It's about today. Well, there's always a buzz in the city when this derby comes along, and uh, I think we're going to see some terrific football because two strong teams here. Got the Everton lineup for you. Virgil van Dijk plays with Daley Blint in defence. Son Hyung Min starts looking to continue. Nice. Great form. Semi early goal will uh man of the match last time out. Semi semi. Thibaut Courtois starts in goal. David Alaba starts with Nathaniel Klein as the wide defenders. Deli Ali starts with Renato Sanchez in central midfield. A cup of competition. There's also something else. Bane is the main man for his side. I want only adults watching. The guys watching. He's that, oh but they already probably know. They're probably like. Trundle on into the net. Yeah, uh, a little chuckle to himself. <laughs> I'm sure to his teammates. He'd be proud of that one.
So the first goal, it's 1-0. Oh, Gabriel Palis. Anyway, I got my goal for Sadio Mane. Seven minutes in. Fantastic. And I put a pressure on everything. Who the hell is this guy? He went to We're going to get a new player. I have absolutely no idea who the hell he is. Galloway. McCarthy. I think I would have known. I'm getting him. Doing well to keep the ball. Wouldn't know because he, he was definitely. Paco! A great work by the keeper. Play. And then he will. Merseyside Darius from last season saying that. There's a chance playing at home to extend this run of two consecutive victories into three. Yeah, and the way they played in those previous two, I, I can see them making it three as well. He may have been injured. I don't know. Reflected behind. Al Sharani. I'm just worried about. I probably butchered. That. I apologize. Um, if I did, but yeah, yeah. I have absolutely no idea who this guy is. He will be pretty wet after five minutes. Looks like he's playing right back. Thibaut Courtois. Well, he must be pretty happy, this lad, because the manager has been spotting out how well he's playing, and he knows how well he's playing. Well, he does, and the trick is to continue that, which isn't always a straightforward thing, because good runs of form come to an end sooner or later. Firmino! What a header from Roberto Firmino. In the match, they've pushed their lead now to two ahead. they played well to this point. But the cross-in. A, a bullet on the header. That is a great goal of its time. From see as the Brazilian the man himself. Yeah, it is still one of the, the best sights in football, and I think nice. supporters enjoy it. It's a spectacular header. Huh, it is. I was thinking, he hasn't scored yet, has he? <laughs> the majority of the goals have been coming from my front two. And Renato Sanchez is throwing a few as well. I think Coutinho is one. Blint. I'll probably look at that as that's in depth when I finish recording. It here. Moving from one side to the other. Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. Goal kick to come. I can see why they got him. He's got a great crossing. Roberto. I put Talibas cross for the Firmino goal to shame. As in, it's a shame to all crosses everywhere. Or, that have ever happened in this ever. Part of the pitch. He's got his tackle in, and the ball's gone out now. So we've got a corner coming up. Fire that tackle. Uh, well, let's try this again. Oh, man, they didn't connect with it as uh, Firmino had on the, for that second goal. One back very quickly. Moving forward with some danger. The break is definitely Just power on. through everyone and score. And there it is for Liverpool. For Liverpool. It is he is freaking waltz through like absolutely short, no one was in the way. Should be home <laughs> the Everton oh, well, players well, may as well have well, not well. been there. Or that's how little they did on that. Liverpool are really on top form in this first half. Three nil. Luke Wait, did I just see the name I think I saw? Son, as in Hugh Mick Son. Huh. This could be it. I can't. I can't say that. That uh, transfers this would be eager to do in real life. <laughs> uh. And he's headed it goalwards. In his time at Southampton, Sadio Mane had scouts from all the big clubs. Looking at no, it could just be. He got his move that he wanted really. Son, to, uh, so it, it could still be you. It could be you, man. Oh! Ah! Onto the attack now. I'm not sure, does he? 
I already pay attention. That defender acted very to, uh, promptly and decisively. Opposition players once they score against me. And they've cut it out. Uh, okay. Prick. Well, the action is going to continue. Uh, but we've got four minutes, minutes of added time. I don't know. Does Son have? That's a great interception. Is he just called hate son? When it, or does... Because I could have sworn. Maybe I'm thinking of a past FIFA. But I could I thought his thing said HG son. As in he... I mean not HG. HM. How am I getting a... HG? Where the fuck did I get a G? HG. What the fuck is a G Alan, sum it up for us. G Court, where the fuck did you get to G? Oh my god. I thought it said H M's on. I don't know for sure. Maybe that's a per that was a previous FIFA. Apparently I made up someone called you one sided. Grandson? I don't I don't know. His parents are a big fans. I don't fucking know. Good, I don't. And shoots. Ali, good save from Bama. Coming up, a corner. That's interesting. The corner count to this point. He's got his shot off now. Very good tackle. Building steadily here, keeping possession. So, not a great cross at all in the circumstances. And pretty easy to cope with, but shots on here. Ali, this time from the keeper. Well, he's kept going, hasn't he? He's kept his head up, and uh, maybe that'll be the turn in terms mm -hmm. of his form out here. Coming up for you on EA Sports. Don't forget, don't miss this: the coverage of the Premier League fixture, Everton. They'll be facing West Ham United away from home. Yeah, a lot of people have been talking about this one. Looking forward to it. Well, There's good progress with this attack. And the defender tidies that up. Substitution for Everton coming off the pitch. What about Liverpool's next game? They're playing Brighton and Hove Albion in their next match. Don't see them having too many problems. Keeper's done very well here. Yes! Mane makes it 4 0. Fantastic football, really, to lead to a goal like that. Well, talk about luck. The keeper makes a good save, but straight into the path of the attacker. Smash the home, because why the fuck not? Nine league goals from Mane. So they're looking for more at 4 0. And then Keyes is looking to get back his trophy. Trophy of uh, the top goal scorer award. Golden boot. Well, this is a real shock. You can see it in the faces of the players. Yeah, it is, isn't it? You can hear it in the lack of noise, if you like, from the supporters. Yeah, well, those fans can't even. Be uh, they will agree you will not give it up so easily, especially when he makes it 5 0. Very competitive uh, Merseyside Derby, no? Important moment, maybe the <laughs> most important moment in the match. They shouldn't be caught from here, should they, Alan? I don't think so. There'd be questions asking. Wait, five? To be honest with you, Martin, the opposition. Oh, yeah, Manny scored a hat trick. <laughs> 5 0, and the game underway again. Return pass. That's how he's so many goals ahead of uh, 20 minutes Diva. now remaining. I thought they were a lot closer than that. <laughs> but uh, I completely blanked on Mane. On to the attack now. Rough. For the previous episode. And shoots! Good block. We've well, got his fist to it. Well, 
Well, he took it on from a long way out, and I'm afraid it's even. I wasn't really at what I had in mind, Nathaniel. Really, wasn't. Really couldn't. At all. Well, to be honest, kind of didn't even hit near the goal. Well, he's kept the ball. I mean, if that were a cross and no one got on the end of it, it'd be a bit more salvageable, but that was an actual shot or press. And that will be Liverpool's one. throw in. Wanting to shoot the ball. Roberto Sanchez. Roberto Firmino. Well, awkward. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Here's McCarthy. Now the countdown is to 10 minutes left. Firmino. Virgil van Dijk. Got the tackle in. Cleared his lines. Ah, damn it. Everton striving with all their might to try and get back into this game, but they're so far behind. Renato Sanchez. Well, when they do say, and you've been in these matches about Go on. the cross money. Why the hell not? Why the hell not? Sayama he reaches double figures. Ten Premier League goals for the season. In game seven, is this? Well, a wonderful achievement to get three goals in a team like this against goals. opposition like this. Yeah, seven. It's a special day. It certainly is. For a special player too, a player that uh, is the clinical sort, and he shows. So he's well on his way. Well, the match. And by well on his way, I mean he's <laughs> got enough to. Uh, Good start if he's uh, eyeing up getting the golden boot back after two years of a Rigi winning. Coming now from Everton. And in goes the cross. There will be a minimum of three minutes of having to I don't know about uh, if he's going to break the uh, all time record because he's a. Uh, 51 goals off of that, off of uh, the, the minimum he will need to break it. Because the record is 60 for uh, Antoine Griezmann. I don't know. It's almost historic. It is a There's a defense bad enough in the Premier League to score for enough goals against. It's going to take some time to live this one down. Yes. Because unfortunately, I can't play the uh, real life Liverpool. Well, that's not a possibility. Alley starts. And even at that, they'd probably play good against me because I'd be a top team. Yep, trying to shape my own team because why the fuck not? Until they, they become consistent, and they'll be always subject to the, the shade. Spurs dropped points again. 17 points. They dropped points again. Brilliant. Now if my AI can do the same. That would be a perfect video actually. Especially if it's another loss. Go on my AI. Go on. No you don't want to. Uh, I'm such a dickhead. I'm such a proper asshole. I mean, nah, nah, I'm an asshole. I'll pretend to hide what I am. Anyway, that's the end of the episode. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Smash the like button if you did. Subscribe if you And until next time, I hope you all have a very, very nice day. Peace.